hello everyone and welcome to my channel today we are going to continue from where we stopped from the previous video which is the dihedral angle of ethane ethane with its sp3 sigma bond between the c c bond is expected to rotate millions of times per second which concludes that its conformation constantly changes so there is a constant change in ethane's conformations which are the eclipsed and the staggered that we explored from our previous video so this change in the conformation that is constant it has are uh, usually done with respect to their conformations energies so this change is highly linked to the change in energies so we are going to explore the energy aspect of ethane's conformations so in this case the lowest energy conformation is known to be to be the staggered confirmation and this staggered confirmation as we recall is a type of the hydra angle which is 60 degrees yep 60 degrees and this will generate a lower energy and uh, why is this meant to be um, before we look at the why we want to look at the ones that will give us a higher energy however uh, in the case of eclipse sorry we're going to have a higher energy and eclipse with a higher energy will have a dihedral angle of zero degrees in here um, the eclipse confirmation will have some interaction of the electrons um, when the front and the back CH points are, al are aligned at this particular angle here um, therefore this generates um, an energy increase Uh, I would say a potential energy increase of 12.6 kilojoules per mole so that would be the potential energy increase in our for way to generate the eclipse confirmation as a result of the electron density between the front and the back CH bond um, that leads to a repulsion and this repulsion needs to be overcome by introducing this particular energy 12.6 kilojoules per mole and um, therefore this generates that particular energy which is quite higher than the staggered confirmation now I'm going to draw a graphical relationship between the potential energy and the dihedral angle as we rotate every 60 degrees um, about the CH or oh, sorry about the CC bonds of ethane 60 degrees every 60 degrees and this will be done by using the Newman's projection so in this case here I'm going to draw the graph here and I'm going to show you the relationship between the potential energy and the dihedral angle so on the x-axis we're going to have the dihedral angle 
or angles that will be investigated with respect to the potential energy. So here I think I'm going to assume this particular point here to be zero potential energy and all the way up here is positive. So in here I'm going to start by making this particular region here zero degrees and move every 60 degrees all the way to 180 degrees. So you might recall that um, the energy required for we to go from the staggered to the eclipsed is 12.6 kilojoules per mole. So in here I'm going to make my reference here where the energy here will be 12.6 kilojoules per mole. So what do we have here? If you stay out at zero degrees, what we get is the eclipsed confirmation, which is at its highest point due to the electron electron repulsion between the CH front and back bonds. And then, as you get closer to 60 degrees, which is the staggered, what we get is there is a decrease in the potential energy where. The overall structure becomes more stable and we have that less repulsive force between the two bones and that will give us the staggered and as we move up again we move to 120 degrees which leads to another form of eclipse and then we come down again to the staggered which is 180 degrees. So in here, what do we get? We have a situation where in the Newman projection, we're going to have at zero degrees, the atoms, um, the back carbon with their hydrogens over there. And then we move, we don't move at all we stick to the same point here and this is where we have the high electron density within the two bonds and a huge repulsive uh, force which we need to be overcome by introducing this much energy and then as we move over to the next stage what we get is that the front um, car had um, carbon um, hydrogens will be twisted 60 degrees in a clockwise direction and the back um, carbon hydrogen um, will be left untouched and this is from 0 to 60 degrees and this leads to the staggered case and then when you move over again we rotate another 60 degrees to form 120 and what do we get? We have this coming back to the initial spot and we get back to the same case, the eclipse. Yep, the eclipse and finally we make our 180 rotation from 120 using the front um, carbon where the back carbon remains in the same position and then you move that another 60 degrees and what do we get we have these moving over here this moving over here and this moving over there which is our 180 rotation for ethane and now what do we get from this particular case so what we derive from this exercise is that we notice that as a thing rotates towards an eclipse confirmation to our going from here to there um 
its potential energy increases. Now, the question is, why this increase? We know that the increase is due to the electron density between the sp3 uh, slash 1s um, bond um, that exists uh, between the c h is of the front and the back and um, this electron density of the sp 3 1s bond of both cases um, will require some energy of 12.6 kilojoules per mole to overcome the repulsive force um, also another factor is the resistance of the rotation by twisting the twisting resistance is called the torsion now string and this torsion now string exists uh, in form of its energy and this energy is required to overcome um needs to be overcome in this case so to overcome this energy the energy is also attached to the sp3 uh, repulsive force energy which is 12.6 and the energy is called the torsional energy which is a resistive force as well and um, this force or, or this energy contributes to the increase in the potential energy as we approach the eclipse from confirmation so this is about it for this video thanks for watching in our next video we would explore the confirmation of propane and butane hit the like button subscribe and share have a good day peace